there, Simon from simonwood.com. A bit of a naughty video today. Uh, when, when I say naughty, it's not going to be me taking my clothes off or anything, but what I mean by naughty is, look, I've got this bottle here, and uh, if you see it, I go, ah, it's all gone. It's not, actually, it's not quite all gone. Um, I've got the remainder of, um, of what was in there in my glass now. Uh, the wine is Blandy's 20-year-old Terrantes, uh, Meo Doce, or as it said on the front, uh, medium rich. Now, uh, normally when they when they categorise Madeira, they they have it in um, uh, upper grade Madeira. Let's call it that one. Uh, they they have uh, from driest to sweet as it goes. Cercial, uh, Vidello, uh, Boile and Malmsey. Uh, Tarantes is, 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 I don't know what, I don't know why it doesn't get included in in that cl uh, classification, uh, but. Um, there isn't all that much of it planted on the island or, or the, on, on, on the bits where they, where they, where they make, uh, make Madeira. But um, you taste a wine like this and you think, why isn't there more of this? Uh, what's good about it? Well, it, apart from the fact that uh, what's bad about it is I've, I've, I've finished the, the, the finished the bottle I've got. Um, and uh, the reason I've finished the bottle I've got is it's got this, it, it's this lovely halfway house between the rich heady style of Malmsey, um, and uh, which has these uh, rich, juicy, um, rum-soaked raisin uh, characters, and the scalp itching style of Cercial, so that dry um, bit of mahogany furniture in there, uh, lots of walnuts and nuts and uh, other nuts and almonds and dried fruit in abundance. Uh, one of them is almost a bit too rich. One of them is also almost a bit too severe. Not as notice as I say almost almost. Bottles of Madeira don't really good Madeira don't last really long around my house, but um, and this is definitely a, a good bottle of Madeira. Um, yeah, you probably can't see the colour really. I'll see if I can hold it up against uh, my green back wall. Uh, I don't know if that made any difference, but um, I stick my nose in there, and it's got these. It's got the aged character. It's got this what they call the dry burnt sugar edges. Uh, the fur, the um, yeah the, the little bit bit of those uh, polished furniture uh, the Christmas cake fruits um, and but it's it's this lovely mixture of richness and freshness um, the sort of wine I could uh, sit and sip and uh, swig perhaps uh, until the cows come home uh, unfortunately. Um, the cows have beaten me to it and I've got to the end of my bottle so maybe this last little bit I should. Uh, I should reserve and uh, see if I can keep it going for another, uh, do you reckon there's 10 minutes worth of wine in there? There probably is if I do uh, in, enough sniffing. If I do too much slurping, it will all have gone, hey? Eh? Ah, what's a man to do? I think I'm just going to go away and have a good, have a good time with it, whatever I do. Anyway, see you soon.